This is coming with us. This is gonna actually go in my office. Now I get to use my caraway uh, pots and pans. They're really cool. This is our garage that's gonna be turned into the amazing FFT workshop. Hey guys, welcome back to the vlog. It is the day after moving in and spending the night for the first time in our new home. How was it? It was good, I liked it, I felt comfortable. It honestly already feels very homey even though there's absolutely nothing besides a bed in it, but hey, that's fine. Yeah. Um, and then we just filmed an ending to this video. If you haven't checked it out over on our main channel, you'll love it. It was one of my favorite flips for sure and it's sold, so that's even better. Um, so just putting the garage back together uh, for the next probably whew, month or so, we are going to be moving and grooving all over the place pretty much. Um, you know, we've got things here, we've got things at the other house um, that we're having the Airbnb and then we are basically gonna be moving it gradually all to our new house. So when I put this back together so that my dad can park in here, um, we are gonna head over to the Airbnb house. We're just gonna call it the Hanscom house because that's the neighborhood it's in, so just call it that. The Hanscom house to basically upload some footage for Harrison, our editor, and then we are going to grab another load of things and probably stay there for a while um, to start getting that place cleaned up. We made it back to the house and then we realized again how much stuff we have. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Okay, so where to start? We don't really know. We keep going back and forth, but I think what we're gonna do, which I did start to do at one point, is like get a trash pile, a donate pile, and a keep pile, donate slash sell. Um, as of now, we're not going to get like our, we're not gonna bring this couch over. Again, we're really planning on doing like a long-term rental here. So we're gonna need to furnish it. Something for like a traveling nurse or something like that. So we're gonna leave some furniture here and just wait till the right stuff comes along for our rental house. So for the moment, I'm kind of thinking we'll bring these orange chairs over. Um, they're super comfy, they're faded, so I'm not sure how they'll sell, but once we're done with them and we find what we want, um, I think that's when we will go ahead and, you know, sell these off. But for now, they're gonna be perfect for our living room. So we're gonna load these up and then just get after it. actually go in my office got it a long time ago I have like basket inserts and door thingies to also put it on put on it so I'm excited to put that all together I'll load this in the truck all right I'm gonna do a little quick update We've been working for maybe like 30 to 40 minutes and we've gotten some progress done. So let me show you. So all of this up here, this leads upstairs and all of this piling stuff over here is like to go upstairs basically. Um, and then this whole area, this is our trash and recycle pile. So that is kind of getting bigger, but we'll make that trip like all at once. And then we've still got to do something about this. This piece of furniture is staying here um, for the rental. So that just needs to get cleaned off and cleaned out a little bit more. 
um, come over here. All of this stuff is staying, so we put it over by the couch uh, for now. We will be taking our TV, just not at the moment. And then um, over here is looking the best. Basically, we've just loaded up a bunch of boxes and gotten everything out of here that we needed to. Uh, we'll be back for the desk and the office setup. This specific desk will actually be going into my office and this guy is getting a new desk. Are you excited about it? Yes, I am. What shape is it? Uh, a, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K. L. It's an L-shaped desk, so he'll have more room for all Extra of curriculars. Stuffs. Now, I think I'm going to kind of start um, over here. This is all just glass, needs to get recycled, blah, 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 blah. I'm going to tackle some more of the kitchen. Okay, we're making progress. Um, I've got a majority of the dishes and stuff packed up. There's still more down below though, and the pots and pans, I think maybe we'll stay here since now I get to use my caraway uh, pots and pans. They're really cool. So then we won't need to bring those pots and pans because I got my new ones. And then, so we're just gonna like probably load up all the boxes we have and then make a trip over to the house. Is that taped on the bottom? It yeah. just looks like it's coming off on the right. Okay. So, time to go to the house again. We made it. I heard that dog in the morning. Yeah, I know, I saw you put a pillow over your head. That was both because of you and the dog. Oh. <laughs> Welcome to the real crib. Where we'll be spending 90% of the time. This is our garage that's going to be turned into the amazing FFT workshop. And there's so much built in storage, and all my tools can hang up here, and, and a little workbench, and tools over here too. And behind this is going to be my staging wall. We're going to move this over there, probably slap a baseboard on there, have some nice flooring. Nice little staging wall. There's so much room. And a pole. Yeah, I could probably just, I'll probably just paint the pole like black or something. Um, so it's not just like And recycled trash and compost. Yeah. does it. Lore is over at her parents' house. She's downloading, uploading video for tonight, which is a great piece. So that's going to be fun. We don't have any Wi-Fi here. We won't have them out here to install until next Tuesday. This is all my office stuff and that's going to be the office. I don't want to bring everything in there and then clutter that because I'll probably end up piecing stuff together and then moving it in there so that it's not all just a mess because that'll mess with my mind. So I don't know what to do. I think we're gonna go over to Laura's parents' house. It's like five minutes, two minutes, three minutes, four, well, you know, one of those minutes. It's a few minutes away. And then probably just pick up some stuff from there since we're gonna be over there. Bring it back here and then, yeah, we'll go from there. See you over there. Showing dad the crib. Mom's out of town. Mom's out of town. I get the VIP treatment. Yeah, you do. This is the basement, laundry room. Really? <laughs> no, I gotta go. <laughs> gotta go, we gotta go. Hold on. This is the 
basement. This is the basement, huh? Mm -hmm. This is going to be Neiman's office. She's already thinking about painting the cabinets. Oh, yeah. What's that? She's already thinking about painting the cabinets. I'm sure. <laughs> I'm sure. Yeah. I'm putting new hardware on. I mean, the hardware is honestly not bad. It just needs to be, like, refreshed and cleaned up. I was personally thinking, like, a white on top and then, like, a nice green on the bottom, like a darker green. Hmm. But obviously that's gonna a weird bathroom. Cause well, this is so far it's not weird. It's got a toilet. <laughs> but this is what yeah. I was trying to tell you. Shower the, this and is toilet. The, yes, I have not ever seen one quite like that. <laughs> no, that is weird. I've not ever quite seen one like this. But you got two people going to the bathroom at the same at time. At the same time. <laughs> <laughs> it's the next day okay so we are at my parents house we actually just sold this black dresser that's been it's been a while uh, I redid it a couple of times well just once actually um, added the base but finally sold it so we're gonna be delivering that on Sunday but we're here so we're like might as well grab a load I'm gonna get all of my clothing and put it in my Jeep so that I actually have a wardrobe over at the new house we also stopped and picked up some furniture from the storage unit so that we could um, start you know furnishing the house a little bit I had a chair I wanted for my office and then even had a shelf he wanted for his office so look over on FFT very soon because those flips are going to be coming up and here comes Neiman with a load I think I have too many clothes Whew. all right now I'm gonna go through them as I put them in my closet because I know there's a big closet but I'm not even sure if all this will fit in there now Granted, some of it is like flipping clothes, so I need to keep those. I always have this little predicament of, like I'm always wearing flipping clothes because I'm never sure what I'm gonna be painting. So I don't really have that many times where I'm like not painting that I just wear regular clothes. And if I do, I pretty much tend to wear the same things over and over. So I've done this several times. But I think this time I'm really going to weed out the things that I maybe don't wear as much. Just a little picture of the pile for you. <laughs> oh my gosh. They kind of got all messed up. But all of those have to go into here. I mean, it's a big closet. So we've got a lot of room to work with. So this side I think is going to be my workout side. Anything that I work out in will go here and I like to separate it by color and by like style. So like long sleeves here, sweatshirts can go there. And then I like to do t-shirts and tank tops. So these will be workout tank tops. I don't, I don't know. Some of them are like, kinda. So I might just have a section for like, t-shirts only. Let's get going. coming together 
I've got all of my workout stuff, t-shirts, tank tops. I was able to fit my flipping clothes in here uh, because I, I got rid of all like a bunch of other clothes. And then here is all of my like, I guess, nicer clothes, if that makes any sense. And then I will show you the clothes that I'm getting rid of. I'm proud of myself, even though it's not even that much, but here it is. I mean, that's a pretty substantial amount. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, 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 tw
I was thinking that the kitchen cabinets, the lower ones, would be so pretty in this color. Wouldn't it? Wouldn't it? I'm gonna ask my landlords. Just, just not yet. Not quite yet. Gotta work up the courage for that one. So I'll just store the lids on the pans. And I'll show you guys when I use them for the very first time. There's like super specific instructions. Like you, I have to read it again, but you don't, I think you don't need cooking spray or if you do use cooking spray, then you're supposed to, you know, only do it for so, only do it a certain way and then not do too high of heat on the pans. They're supposed to be non-stick. I don't know. I'm excited. So that is to come. Okay, we're moving around a lot. We're back here and we're gonna get my desk. It's gonna go in the truck. So we're gonna get that loaded up, but it is massive and heavy, but we don't wanna take it apart. We still might have to take it apart. I don't know if it'll make it up the stairs. Hopefully it'll make it up the stairs, but first things first, we gotta get it out of this house. Another next day, um, we went to a fish fry last night and then just came home. Well, actually didn't come home. Well, I came home and then I went back out. I went to TJ Maxx and I went to Target to just grab some things, the house things that you need, you know? So I grabbed a lot of cleaning supplies and a lot of organizational type things. Um, so I got a little like Lazy Susan type thing that has different levels from TJ Maxx. I got a leather Lazy Susan for like spices. Like I said, I'm going to put that up in the cabinet here. Um, I just got some more utensils because we didn't have any type of spatula. Um, either this type of spatula or this type of spatula. So, needed that. Um, what else did I get? Oh, I got another like spice rack type thing to just stack different things. Um, I got towels for the bathroom. I got these cool little uh, fairy colanders or any type of thing you want to like clean and then store in the fridge in this container instead of having like those you know blueberry containers or whatever um i got an expandable silverware holder because the one that we had just doesn't fit in it it's too small for the drawer and so there's like a lot of wasted space and i don't really like that so grab this that in a little bit there's only one little towel rack and so it's behind the door we don't really like the placement so I grabbed this so that we can actually hang it like on the door and both of us can hang our towels on there um, oh I got like, some hand soap some things like that I got um, some towels for the bathroom. So right now what I'm doing, oh, and then I went back this morning and I got some more stuff from Target, um, a little organization thing for Neiman's closet and some baskets. And then I did get some like kitchen towels and things like that. So what I'm doing right now is just like detagging all of them and I'm gonna go throw them in the laundry. So I got these little pellet thingies i've never used them before but i feel like our clothes and towels just need like fresher scent a fresher scent so i'm going to attempt to use this um i don't know exactly ah okay 
just gonna put some of these. So let's put them in the bottom of the washer. So I'm not gonna do too many, but enough. And then hopefully that will kind of freshen up our towels and things. And I grabbed our shower towels as well, just to go ahead and get those washed. I'm always curious how Tide Pods work. Like, do they just eventually just like pop and then the soap goes everywhere? How does that work? I'm curious. All right, towels are in the wash. So this is kind of gonna be Neiman's bathroom. And then I'm gonna use the like main bathroom as my bathroom. Um, so he's cleaning out his like little medicine cabinet thingy. He found some cool. glasses and some toothbrushes yeah, some and stuff toothpaste. Left over. <laughs> um, and then also inside the drawers, we're going to like put some drawer liner so that this doesn't sit directly on the wood, things like that. Dude wipes for every dude out there that doesn't have these are missing game changer. Let's just say that we sent some to our editor as well, and he took them to his for his Vegas vacation. Use them, absolutely love them. So he's officially a dude wiper as well. Join the club. We're not sponsored. Feels good on the bum holio. <laughs> super weird thing to always want but I figured it would just be easier to be able to like grab these laundry bags throw them downstairs or whatever and then also having three different compartments we can sort co colors we can sort by my clothes and even clothes or we can I definitely want to put like hangers in one of them so that way I always have a stock of hangers but I'm gonna put this together real quick so that we can have a pretty looking hamper. There we have it. It's a tiny bit, like maybe the baskets are a little bit smaller, but I figured, like smaller than I thought, I figured dark clothes, colors, and then whites can go in there, whites and like light grays. But I, it was really easy to put together and I think it'll be very functional for us. And then these just, I think you can just like pull them right off and like bring it downstairs. So we're delivering it today, as well as going to check out some furniture for our house, um, for our room. We found some really cool stuff from some people that we actually know. So we got the inside uh, scoop on it. Yeah, it's like I would pay, I wouldn't pay this much if I were refinishing and selling. Uh, but for us, you know, obviously we're willing to pay up a little bit because then technically it's like less than we would really pay for like new stuff so it's some nice stuff we are gonna go find that or look at that stuff first and then deliver that and then we've got one more photo to pick up too So now we have one more pickup. It's probably about maybe like another 20 minutes away. So we're gonna go get that. All right, we got our last piece back there. It's another beautiful French provincial piece. And I'm so glad that we finally sold that black piece that I actually made over two times. 
anyway you guys thank you guys so much for watching there will be tons more vlogs coming your way with us continuing to move into our house and then i'm hoping to also bring you guys along for like you know office makeovers and just setting up different rooms throughout the house and things like that so definitely get subscribed down below if you haven't already as well as get subscribed over on friendship living teacher because we are going to be making over that furniture that we picked up this morning and we're going to be making it over for our room it's going to be epic we haven't quite decided and nailed down the exact design plans yet so if you have any ideas, let us know. You guys know what color my our bedspread is, so we want it to kind of complement that and also have some wood tones. But other than that, you guys, we will see you next week. Thank you for watching. Oh! Are you gonna help me? Whoa! See, see you on, on the flip, flip side. side. <laughs>